Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to upcycle your shoes that you're not wearing often and also in gift idea. Before that, make sure to check out this holiday giveaway collab with 9 other girls. And we're going to show you all about how to be faster for the holiday, either makeup, outfits, or even a DIY. Don't forget to watch their videos to get inspired. So for me, I wanted something that's budget friendly for a gift idea, so I thought monogram and something for him, of course. Why not some Alexander McQueen inspired loafers and whatever you're obsessed with. You can see I'm obsessed with owls lately, so let's transform these shoes in 5 minutes. Find a pair of shoes you want to update, either ballet flats, smoking slippers, or even loafers for men. Stuff it with tissue into the toe box because we're going to decorate that area. And clean the surface first before you start anything else. This one had a bowl in the front so I decided to glue it to the back. I'm using multi-purpose super glue. You can also use fabric glue and add a dab to the bow in the center of the knots. And you can pretty much apply this anywhere you like on the shoes. I just apply this to the back with a pair of hair clips. You can also use clothespin too to keep it in place and let it dry for 24 hours. Okay, so I'm pretty sure you want to look to how to get those um, designs in the front part of your shoe. So you need some iron-on patches, which you can find at the Fabric Craft Store. And I have links down below for those and also online. Some of the iron-on patches do come with paper backing, so peel that off first. Now, where you want to place it? I prefer to place it right in the middle. How I found that is by inserting my index and middle finger inside of the shoe and using the thumb to anchor the patch at the center. Or if you have a pointy shoe like this, just use the middle of the point. If you have a middle initial, you're going to start off with that letter in the center of the shoe before you place the first and last initial around it, just to make sure it's straight and even. Now you're going to set the iron on high heat and you're going to need eventually a thin towel or a pillowcase to iron on the patch, but I like to just start off by iron the center or the edge of the patch first to make sure it's sticking to the shoe before placing the towel or pillowcase on top and iron it on because if you decide to place the towel or pillowcase beforehand with a non-stick patch it can slip and slide on your toe box and end up with a crooked logo or patch which doesn't look great and you can't redo the shoe. So now for the monogram, you're going to repeat this step by applying your first initial. Then the last step is iron on the last initial and making sure it looks perfect. Like you got it at the store and they custom made the shoe for yourself or for your friends. And this is what I'll be planning to give as a holiday gift for friends and family for the guys and girls. Um, whatever they're interested in, say they're into sports like tennis, I'll find a tennis patch or something. But monograms is a classic look and it's so in trend right now and I'm obsessed with those too. So I hope you guys like this and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!